Hello everyone and welcome back to Man's Life Rollet. Today in this video we are going to discuss about some outside batting strategy. As you know the table has 6 outside position and all these outside position has same odd like uh, whenever you play with $1 and if you own you get back a profit of another $1. Here what we are going to do is uh, we are going to follow the last number. So whatever be the last number this is uh, 28. So this is a black number, this is a even number and bigger number. We can choose any one position. This is for online table. For offline you can randomly choose any position. For online choose any position like a even position, black position or the bigger position. And start with 5 unit. Suppose you are playing with $5 then uh, you, go, you have to go with 25. If you are playing with $1 then start with $5 bets then whenever you own just reduce two unit i am at 25 and i own this one then my next bet should be uh, reducing two unit means 10 dollar it will be 15. again i own it will be five but if i lose this 25 i will increase it to buy two more unit and it will become 35. in this way i have to progress my bets so what is the difference if you put our bets in this way then what will happen generally uh, if I own 25 my next bet will be 15 if I lose this 15 my loss will be 15 but in the previous spin my profit will be 25 so still I am in profit of $10 and after this spin suppose I lose again I lose this 15 then I make $10 profit but if I own again I make 15 over here and my next bet will be 5 and if I lose this 5 again I make profit of $10 over here and this with that difference of $10 after every losing and winning combination will give you the profit so I have a bank of 2000 you can see here and uh, I am going to use my $5 bets as a unit so 25 at the beginning and my target is to make at least $100 as profit once I achieve this $100 no matter what is my bets position and uh, where I am standing with my bet size I will start from the beginning so let's start so I have decided this is last number is 6 so I have decided to go with even number with 5 unit ok 25 total bets ok 12 this time and this is a even number nice win so last spin was a 5 unit bet so it's time to reduce 2 units so it's time for 3 unit bets that means 15 total bet should be 15 and what is the position right now for 12 it might be red it might be even it might be smaller number so i have decided to go with red this time with 15 dollar one two and three okay twenty this time and it's black so i lose over here so time again to increase two more unit that means again i have to bet 25 from 15 to 25 and this time I have decided again to go with even number you can uh, change the position or you can stay with the same position that uh, really doesn't matter because all the number has equal probability what is your advantage your advantage is just the increasing two unit and decreasing two unit so last pin was 25 and I lose that one so it's time for 35 okay one this time and it's a win so from 35 now it's time to reduce so I have reduced it to 25 this time that difference of $10 after every winning and losing combination you make the profit okay one more win so I need to decrease it to from 25 to 15 this time and last number was a black so I should go with black this time you can change the position or you can stay at the same position that really doesn't matter 
So again, it's a loss. So I have to increase from 15. Now again, it's uh, 25. Okay, 25. Okay. So position really doesn't matter. What I am telling is position really doesn't matter. Okay, one more loss. So from uh, 15, uh, 25. Now it's 9 for 35. Okay, number three, and it's a red one, quite nice. So from 35, again, time for 25. Okay, it's 25. In this way, you have to progress your bets until you achieve the target. This time it's a loss. So from 25, time for 35. okay from 35 again it's time for 45 in this way you have to progress your bets until you achieve the target number seven this time and it's a win so from 45 it's time to decrease it to 35 just ten dollar increasing whenever i'm losing and decreasing ten dollar whenever I am in profit, I am winning. Okay, from thirty five, it's time for forty five again. Okay, it's a win. So again, I have to reduce it to thirty five. quite nice from 35 let reduce it to 25 and this time it's a loss so again I have to increase it to 35 one more loss so one more time i need to increase from 35 again it will become 45 and this time it's a win so from 45 time for 35 in this way you can manage your bets and uh, your risk of losing is also quite low okay from uh, 35 now it's time for 45 again that's a win so from 45 again time for 35 and it's a win so finally we have achieved the target uh, we have started from 2000 and our drawdown was maximum 100 not 100 even below 100 but still we achieved the target so this strategy is uh, quite good so let's try another session for another hundred dollar profit and this time I will use only one particular position like even one so I am not going to change the position. Let's see whether we can achieve the target with fixed position or not. Okay, 25 this time and it's a loss. So need to repeat and increase uh, two more unit. Now it's 35. Okay, one more loss I think. Okay. So again we have to repeat and increase two more units. Total bats became 45 this time. Okay, this time it's a win. So time to reduce my bats from 45 to 35. Just a fixed position also you can achieve good target, good profit.
again some profit so need to reduce from 35 to 25 this time this time it's number three or number so it's a loss so again I have to increase from uh, 25 now it's time for 35 yeah again a loss so again have to increase to more unit and total bets became 45 this time one more loss so time again to increase from 45 now it's after two units it is became 55 this time again a loss so lots of losses still yet uh, four conjugative losses but that's okay you can achieve the target uh, because uh, gradually your bad size is increasing so whenever you started making profit you will make profit something more so last win was 65 so let's reduce it to 55 so 30 this time one more win and I have to reduce from 55 it's time for 45 okay nice win and from 45 time to reduce it to 35 okay one more win so again I have to reduce from 35 it's time to 25 you can see here okay it's again a win so from uh, 25 it's time to go for 15 dollar bets and it's also a win so now you can see we have achieved the target quite easily we have started from 2000 in the first session we make 100 in the second session we make 100 so total profit became 200 so why this strategy is so efficient let me explain you whenever you start losing you lose 25 again you lose 35 again you lose uh, 45 again you lose 55 okay but once you started winning after this 55 you if you own you the next bet you own 65 in the next bet you own 55 in the next bet you own 35 sorry 45 and here 35 so every time you own you are winning 10 dollar more than your previous losses and that is the difference that 10 dollar 10 dollar over here 10 dollar over here 10 over here 10 over here so after 10 or 12 spin you will found that you have accumulated hundred dollar out of that ten dollar difference and that is your profit target so i hope you understand what exactly i need to explain so if you can execute this kind of strategy properly then you can make profit from the table before ending the video let me tell you it's a game and it's designed for the advantage of the house if you want to win from the table you need to follow some strategy no matter which way you decorate the table, where you put the bats, the odd will be the same. The only difference you can make is by bats progression, how you progress your bats, how you put your bats on the table, how you increase the bats or decrease the bats after win or a loss. And that will create the difference and give you the profit. I hope you understand what exactly this strategy is. So thanks for watching and good luck for your next game.